Right, with us we have JJ Duisep, the chairman of the Namibia Premier League. Well, JJ, we've just heard the announcement that the league will now definitely start this weekend and uh, quite an increase, a 6% increase in the overall prize money or, um, for the whole year for the league. Tell us more about that, please. You see, we had a three-year budget of uh, a sponsorship deal with MDC and everything was linked with inflation. And this uh, particular season's budget has increased of 6% on top of the last one. And that's why we have 11,294,300 for this season. And what I can say as the league chairman is that I'm only looking forward to a, a good start of the season that will end on a high note. And what I can just say is that my expectation is from the Namibian football fraternity to come on board and get involved in things of common interest so that we can br build a brand of football in our entire country because only through collectiveness can we actually unlock the true value of football in this country. And I am only thanking MDC for the blind statement that they have making to be part and parcel of the NPL in this quest of excellence towards developing football in this country. Right, so that's quite an investment. It works out to about 55,000 per month per club. And besides that, tell us some, uh, some of the other innovations you've got for the season. Yes, we have innovations that we have. We are looking at bringing on board the top eight competitions that will just excite supporters and excite teams for a more competitive uh, display of football on the field of play. Because through innovativeness, can we bring more supporters uh, to, the, to the stadiums and fill the empty stadiums? And I hope teams can actually also do more not only from the NPL side, but as teams, they must also go out there and aggressively market and excite supporters. Right, JJ, and you mentioned that this might be your last year with uh, football. Uh, why is that? My time is coming to an end. I still have one year left, and I must look at other avenues where I can add value, because there might be some youth outside there that might come in and add value, because I don't want to overstay and lose focus. I can only do good now and try and be what I can to the league and add value to the product that I'm currently saving and I will do that until the end of my term.